YouTube and today I'm going to show you MSN Messenger for Mac. So the reason I use MSN on my Mac instead of iChat is because um, iChat doesn't support MSN and there's more people on MSN uh, than on AIM which you can use for iChat. So today I'm going to show you how to get MSN for your Mac. Um, so first open up Safari and the first thing you're going to need is a Windows Live um, account. Um, if you already have a Windows Live account um, skip to what says at the bottom of the screen. Um, if you don't have a Windows Live account, then um, go to go on Google and type in Windows Live, like so, and click on Welcome to Windows Live at the top, or just go to live.com instead, and click Sign Up, and then just um, enter all your details there to get a Windows Live account. Once you have that Windows Live account, the next thing you're going to need to do is to download Windows Live Messenger or um, MSN Messenger for Mac as it's called on the Mac. So open up Safari again, go to Google and type in MSN Messenger for Mac and click on the first one, microsoft.com slash Mac slash products slash messenger. So it should come up with something like this. Um, click on try out messenger for Mac 8 beta with audio and video because uh, messenger Mac 8 is better than me messenger Mac 7 if there's a stable version of messenger Mac 8 um, just use that as long as it has audio and video um, because that's quite an, a good feature to have um, so press download now uh, and then here it says details messenger 8 for Mac just scroll down here I'm just using my magic mouse and then press english.dmg so that's gonna uh, download and uh, download messenger 8 once that's done it'll come up with a disk image here in a second here we are Microsoft Messenger right, so then just expand this like that and drag Microsoft Messenger into applications like that. It will say prepare to copy. Shouldn't take too long. Take about five seconds. Yours might be faster because I'm. Uh, I haven't got a fast map. Okay, so then click on applications and then uh, Microsoft Messenger. It, it won't have the image yet, but once you've run it, then it will come up with it. Um, it will come up with it. Press open like that. And you can drag this here, or wherever you want on your dock. And once you let go, it will keep it there on your dock from now on. You can check that by holding, holding down, press options, and then keep in dock, make sure it's ticked. Unless you don't want it to keep in your dock, you can untick that. Okay, so now that we've got that, we don't need this anymore, so I'm just going to click that. Okay, um, let's close that, make sure it's gone personal contacts, and then sign in with that Windows Live ID that um, which you have. Okay, so um, thank you for watching. Um, please rate, comment, subscribe, and if um, please comment and say if there's a way that I can improve my videos. Because uh, I'm interested. Uh, thank you for watching. Goodbye.